uh, as people watched the uh, the vehicles uh, uh, drive around, many people remarked about how smooth and natural, uh, uh, particularly Boss, seemed to be on the street. Uh, how far off is this technology from use in everyday vehicles? Some of the technology in Boss um, are already in cars. If you uh, want it, you buy it. Uh, those are examples like um, keeping distance from a next vehicle during uh, automated cruise control, uh, parallel parking, commercial feature. It's not uh, whether the features will reach cars, it's just um, how they get into the market a little bit at a time. The uh, commercialization uh, has gone on for years and will continue forever in cars. Uh, it's not uh, like the Big Bang creation of the universe where nothing happened, nothing happened, and then it's all there. Uh, uh, automated cars uh, occur an inch at a time. The university, of course, is proud of the team. Uh, do you think this will have an impact on Carnegie Mellon University? Every great robot adventure uh, has a favorable effect at Carnegie Mellon. Uh, when Dante went into a volcano, uh, applications go up, quality profiles go up, and uh, lots of people want to come here. Mail is pouring in from around the world about uh, uh, people from India and China and uh, Singapore and Europe who um, want more of what we've got. So what's next? For all the, uh, for all the wonder of the urban challenge, uh, the past becomes the past pretty quickly. The urban challenge is history. Uh, next up is the moon. Uh, the Google Lunar X Prize offers $25 million for a good robot to deliver uh, a broadcast from the moon. Uh, that uh, sounds like it has our name on it. Uh, uh, we're going to go get it.